All right, what's well, good, everybody? It's game time, and uh, just figured I'd knock out a quick commentary here. Uh, this is a game of Team Deathmatch on Three Kingdoms. It seems like I've been doing a lot of Three Kingdoms videos lately, I guess. Just been coming up more in the playlist or whatever. Um, but uh, this is Team Deathmatch. I think it's a 10 minute game. And, uh, yeah, this isn't the greatest game I've ever played, but. Uh, I decided to put first it up just to, because I haven't done commentary in a while and have been playing a lot of pubs lately to be honest with you. Uh, so I just figured I'd put this out there just to, um, yeah, just to get a commentary out there and kind of uh, you know, keep keep the videos rolling, I guess. Uh, as most people know, we're, uh, my team Remedy is in the uh, yeah, game battle playoffs for the ladder. Uh, that'll be starting uh, next week, and um, you know, basically just been practicing. Most of the videos I've been putting up lately have been from practice. Um, and watch that guy out. Oh, got a kill. I get a boy. Oh. Um. Yeah, but anyway, I hadn't watched that video yet. But anyway, um. So basically, most of my videos have been from our scrims and practices against each other, and uh, you know I'll be getting back to you know more variety of videos here once once playoffs is over. But you know, for now, that's going to be the majority of the videos to, to get this one out there for everybody. Um, yeah, there's a couple things. There's definitely going to be a couple of learning points in this video. A couple of things I can point out. Um, you know, basically. This is just my pursuit of trying to get to their spawn in camp so I can push them back just like with any other map. Um, I'm not getting a lot of resistance on the way they're spawned from the left side. So I continue to push left side most of this game. Uh, and I'm getting to their spawn pretty effortlessly. Um, let's see. I got a teammate going with me. He don't want to mess with me with that 6x. Nope. <laughs> Alright, so I have pretty much free reign up to the spawn here. I'm going to try to control both sides of it. I'm in this room by myself. None of my friends are here. Um, they're actually in a match I just got on. And uh, so we're just... Uh, uh, we're just, just trying to hold this spawn down. I'm not sure how the dude didn't die. But see, I can see him on radar, so I know when he's coming back out and exactly where he's going to be. Aim and shoot. Um, that's one thing a lot of people don't realize, when you shoot, you show up on radar, so why not use the radar to your advantage? When they're shooting at you, look at the radar, see where they're at. That's why a radar jammer is such a, such a powerful tool, because you can then block the radar so they can't see you. So, just something to think about. I use radar jammer a good bit uh, for just that reason, especially on games where there's no respawns. Yeah, I was able to get away from him and reload. Um, just not sure if I'm going to make it out here or not. I see where he's at on radar. Because he had shot at me. Had I not seen him on radar there, he probably would have surprised me because I was definitely going to aim at the dragon there. I'm not really sure what happened there. I got killed by the host, I guess. My shots didn't register or whatever. Um, let's see. What's going on with me? Well, um... Yeah, basically we're um, we're trying to take uh, take our team remedy and kind of make it multi uh, kind of branch out a little bit. We have made uh, Call of Duty teams for Modern Warfare 2 and Black Ops. Uh, I'm not sure how active we're going to be with those just yet. At least not until after the uh, the playoffs are over here. Um, but we're putting some teams together. We're going to be trying to put some people people on those teams bringing some people for them and um, we've also discussed uh, making a website and uh, just kind of branching branching the uh, remedy brand out a little bit you know we're a pretty tight group and uh, you know, we just want to uh, you know kind of stick together and keep the remedy brand out there and you know just keep keep playing and getting better and you're being more competitive, that's what we do. So, uh, definitely be on the lookout for more from us. Uh, 
I'm going to be doing some live video streaming. I don't know if I'm going to do it during the playoff match or not because it does give me a little bit of lag on my internet. Um, I need to fool around with it a little bit more. Uh, it also doesn't bring sound, but it is uh, it's still really fun to do. I know some people watched when I did it uh, last week and they really enjoyed it. So we'll see. Uh, here's one of those learning experiences. Uh, those guys just kill me in the spawn. This is how you don't spawn a camp, okay? Guess what? I spawn. This dude's still sitting back in the corner. He's dead. And this other kid's still sitting in the same spot. He's dead. Both of them before my spawn shield even goes away. I mean, that's just, they're too, first of all, they're too close. You want to be where they, where the person's alive for three seconds before you shoot them. Uh, they weren't. They're directly in the spawn. That's just dumb, just dumb playing. You know, why would you do that? Um, and especially you got lucky one time, why would you just sit in the same spot? It just makes no sense. A you know, better place to be would have been outside there on the steps or out on the front patio where I'm at now. Um, you know, then you can possibly pick up the kill. But in the spawn, you're going to get lucky once, if that, and that's all. So, just something to think about when you're uh, playing a team deathmatch and you're pushing back on somebody that's definitely a way something you may want to think about. Um, let's see, one of my friends is in the game now, Voodoo, uh, from GPO. Uh, shout out to him. I don't know if he watches my videos or not, but uh, uh, no shout out to him in GPO. And uh, he's sort of, he's sort of helped me out this game. And uh, let's see, again, I'm going to catch this kid with the 6x. <laughs> I don't know what he's doing trying to throw a grenade, but uh, so basically I'm pushing, pushed back towards the spawn here now. I'm trying to do the same thing as before. I see this guy on radar over here. I'm going to try to catch up to him before he gets to the end of the hall. I'm going to shoot through the bamboo. <laughs> yeah, if you don't know, you can shoot through that bamboo and it's wonderful. Um, if in my last attack and defend video, you saw me clip security through the uh, bamboo right up there. Um, but yeah, it's, it's easily to sh it's easy to shoot through and everything. This is a great place to hide outside the spawn too, because a lot of times they'll walk right past you. This guy actually doesn't, and somehow I was still able to kill him. But he scared the crap out of me. Um, let's see here. So I'm just trying to, basically, just trying to keep control of the map, keep them pushed back. I see somebody kill Voodoo. I don't know where he's at. But uh, now I got this dude on radar over here. So he's. I think he went back into the spawn. There he is. Picked up that kill. And uh, there's a grenade. Just got run away from that. And I'll throw one for them. But, let's see. I probably could have pushed into their spawn right there if I wanted to, but I didn't. You will see me push into the spawn, um, despite the lecture that I just gave a few minutes ago, but this is something I will only do in, like, a public room if I'm just messing around and really don't care. Um, you know, I'll try to get in here, but see, I'm gonna, I will hide as best I can, and uh, unfortunately the host finds me and I'm done. But, you know, it's whatever. But if you're really trying to get kills and you're really trying to get better, that's really not something I encourage. Uh, cause you're gonna end up dead just like I did. Uh, and just like the guys that were in my spawn earlier. So, um, there's a good way to spawn a cam and there's a not so good way to spawn a cam. So I thought there was somebody behind that bamboo there. I guess he kept on moving. Um, so. But anyway, this game's about over. Um, I'm not sure how many more videos we'll be putting up this week. Uh, we got a Hopefully a good weekend of practice here, a match on Monday night, and depending on how I play, you might see footage from that, and uh, we got more, definitely more game, game battles matches from Remedy coming up, uh, possibly some Call of Duty from Remedy, uh, just you know, a little bit, a little bit of everything is going to be coming out here, and uh, definitely lots of rainbow, um, so be on the lookout for that. Um, I'm going to get a couple of cheap deaths here at the end, trying to run out and get kills. But, um, you know, everybody, thanks for watching. Uh, please give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. 
I'm trying to get you know, get plenty of thumbs ups on my videos. It does help them get watched. Uh, it helps more people see the Rainbow Six videos. So you know, please give them a thumbs up if you like it. And uh, thanks everybody for watching. And I am out.